Hi, welcome back to Ideas for Musicians. So I had a thought the other day as I was sitting down to try to write a piece. Um, I was sitting in front of the keyboard and um, you know, I wanted to write something emotional for strings in this case. And nothing was coming to mind. I was a complete blank slate. And I sort of had this thought, you know, maybe it's the, it's the middle of the afternoon. Maybe I'm just in a slump and it's not a good time to try to write music. But if that's the case, you know, that's just a lot less time in your life to write music. So I was thinking, you know, what if I need some kind of a focal point? And in that moment, it really felt like my mind needed a prompt, some kind of a focal point to latch onto that I could then use to jog my creativity. And in this case, I was thinking a lot about writing music to picture. So I thought, hey, you know, what if I grab something off of, say, Vimeo and just use it as like a starting point and start writing to the scene to see if if my inspiration um, might be jogged by that. And sure enough, I turned it on and within minutes, um, melodies started coming to mind, harmonies. And you know, before I knew it, I was off to the races uh, writing a piece and I didn't even need the picture anymore. So I thought, you know, why not do this again? And why don't more musicians use this? You know, we're always looking for ways to jog our creativity and get started. And this was a really fast and efficient way to sort of get going. Um, so, you know, I know a lot of musicians pull music off of Pexels, which is like a free video photo sharing site. Um, so I tried that today. I grabbed some footage from a really amazing videographer, um, aerial videographer who does a lot of landscapes and I'll put his name in the, um, the notes as well. And I just decided to start playing to picture um, and creating like a soundscape and a mood for that picture. So um, I thought we'd just run through that exercise together. And then, you know, I encourage you to, uh, to try it as well next time you're kind of stuck for inspiration. So um, with, without further ado, uh, let's roll the video and start playing some music.
So yeah, as you could probably hear there, um, that was very much improvised and off the cuff. But I don't know. I think it what it does is it sort of gives you a starting point to create a mood. You know, watching video, watching picture, you know, we're also accustomed to to visual media. And I think it immediately kind of contrives an emotion, um, an emotional response in us, really no matter what it is. And that can very easily be translated into music. Say, for example, um, instead of sitting at your desk and staring at the wall, which is far less uh, inspiring. And I'm not saying this is that's this is the only way to do that, but this is one way. Um, I think one tool in our tool belt we can use to sort of um, get started with a new composition or an idea. And if you're looking to write something in a particular genre, maybe you start with that. Maybe you start with a video that sort of fits into that genre or mood. Or if you're just looking to write something, you can just pick something off the internet at random and start creating to it. So hope that was helpful. Hope you enjoyed it. And uh, I encourage you to give it a try. Uh, thanks for watching and we'll see you next week.